Hello, hello, and welcome back, my beautiful moon and stars. It's your girl, Starlight. And in today's video, I'm going to be talking about the signs that you guys are going to see when you are about to level up in life, right? When God is about to level you up, you're going to see major signs, major, you know, things that are going to come in and out of your life when you're about to get this upgrade. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe if you guys are into videos like this. And yeah, well, let's get on to the video. So one of the first major signs you guys will see in your life when you're about to upgrade is everything is going to fall apart. A lot of stuff is not going to go your way. Um, things are going to seem to be very uncomfortable when this happens. It's happened to me a few times, many times actually. Um, it's just like a pattern, you know, eventually you get used to it. It's still not fun when it happens, uh, but that's life, you know? That's, uh, you know, God leveling you guys up, and you, obviously you're manifesting your best life. So things need to be taken away, and things need to get uncomfortable. You need to get uncomfortable in order to have this best life that you are manifesting, correct? Yeah, so it can be a little rough when this does happen, when things aren't going your way I understand it blows it sucks it's, it's doggy poo poo right um you guys are going to notice a lot of things happening it's this it's almost like it's gonna feel kind of like I guess like bad luck in a sense but it's not it's just you know God is kind of just pushing you to where you need to be <laughs> um where he wants you to be right you know mentally physically, spiritually, emotionally, you know what I mean? Like, you need to kind of have it all together before entering this new level, you know what I mean? Entering this, like, upgraded life, this upgraded version of yourself, let's say. There you go. That's what I'm looking for. Um, but yeah, it's like, you know, you need to release a lot of your old self in order to, you know, meet, like, your new leveled up, you know, upgraded higher self of you right that's the best way i can describe it so hopefully that makes sense so that is one of the first signs that you guys are going to see and witness when you're about to level up <laughs> in life when god is you know taking you to higher places right it's nothing to be scared about it's can it can be scary but you guys get used to it there's nothing really harmful god's god has you he's not gonna let anything happen to you you guys are fine you're safe okay don't worry about it so yeah, moving on to the other sign that you guys are about to level up, and that is seeing repeating numbers on a constant, on a daily, okay? And synchronicities too. So just little weird patterns happening daily or every other day. Um, pretty much for me, it's daily. Um, obviously driving, you see license plates, receipts, you know, people even saying, oh, it's 5.55, you know what I mean? like with the, t the time and everything like that um it's just gonna be surrounding you repeating numbers synchronicities it's just the universe telling you hey you're good you're fine you're okay you're on the right path you know especially seeing 11 11 or lots of ones that means you are on like a divine path and you're on the right path so don't worry things are gonna be okay and there's nothing to worry about so that's a nice you know it's like a nice little comforting message from the universe and i always like seeing synchronicities and i like seeing numbers so you guys are going to see a lot of those when you're about to level up <laughs> so be aware of that another big sign that you guys are leveling up god is you know bringing you onto a new and better path a new better journey if you will people are going to leave your life a lot of family, friends, could be anybody, lovers, a lot of people are going to be like plucked from your life. And I know how hard that can be, how that can get, right? And we kind of just have to go with the flow. You know, that's just God's way of, you know, releasing the negative, like people who aren't good for us, you know, who can't be there when we are winning. Because clearly there's something about these people that God does not like or, you know, God sees something in them that we're not seeing. You know, whether it's shown to us by God 
you know, we hear something through other friends or family or whatever, you know, they're talking about us, you know what I mean? Like, just little subtle things like that. You know, pay attention to your dreams, guys. That's a big one. That's how God speaks to me. Um, probably speaks to you guys like that too. Let me know in the comments if he does. But, you know, when people leave your life, when they start to leave your life, don't be upset. I know it's upsetting, but when you're trying to manifest a lot of good things in your life, you're trying to manifest moving to a different house, you know, money, you know, it doesn't matter, you know, a better career, whatever it is, right? Things are going to be removed. You know, you're going to have to give up some stuff, sacrifice some things, right? And I know how hard that can be, you know, because obviously our ego and our pride is like, no, I want it now. I deserve it now. Of course you deserve it, but like, I mean, stay humble. You know, God wants you to stay humble always, you know, before receiving your reward you know what i mean you know a lot of that is going to happen a lot of people are going to leave your life family friends anybody you know and see that as a major sign like see that as a good sign that things are ramping up <laughs> you're about to you're about to like go to the top so don't worry about it you're fine you're in good hands i promise <laughs> god is going to replace those older people you know, those nasty, negative, whoever they were, you know, obviously, clearly, they weren't good for you, right? You know, narcissistic people as well. God is going to replace them with better, loving, kind, generous, good-hearted people. So, don't worry, it's fine. <laughs> so, another major sign that you guys are about to level up, God is about to bring you to the top, right? Is you guys are going to feel something within you you guys are going to feel like something big is about to happen you know maybe like you were a little doubtful at first because that's kind of like a little bonus sign you know maybe you're feeling anxious you're feeling doubtful you're like yo everything is falling apart like i'm struggling right now you know go through that struggle like you have to go through it for a reason right that struggle is good it's it's helping you grow it's helping you become who you need to be you know, for the next level, right? So God needs you to be strong enough for the next level. You guys are going to feel something huge and big is coming into your life. And you don't know what it is, right? It could be your manifestation. It could be something else. It could be something bigger. <laughs> something you didn't imagine ever happening for you. But it's going to happen. And God knows exactly what it is. So keep your faith. Keep your trust in him always. You know, keep praying to God, keep talking to God every day, right? Because literally, that's exactly what you're feeling. Like, God is instilling that that comfort within you. You know, your spirit guides, your angels, like, they're bringing you this comfort, this, like, at ease kind of feeling. You know, after all this chaos and all this crap that's happening in your life and, like, everything's all haywire going to crap and seems like it is, it's really not. It's just... It's just the universe kind of moving stuff around in your life <laughs> to get you where, you where you need to freaking be, right? It sucks, I know, it's, it's a lot, but that's how it is when we manifest. You know, we got to rewire our thinking, you know, our hearts, you know, um, our bodies, you know, we got to take care of ourselves, you know, hydrate and cleanse ourselves, you know, energetically, of course. You know, it's a lot still at the end of the day. It's a struggle. It really is. It can be at times. But when you get this big feeling, when you feel like something is about to happen and, you know, you're really excited about it, because you are. It's going to be like a weird kind of excitement kind of feel, but like you're also anxious and you don't know what the flip's going on. But you feel like something big is about to happen. You don't know when it's literally going to happen like that. Could be anything, right? Could be meeting someone new, new friends, meeting your soul tribe, um... I don't know, winning money, winning the lottery or something like that. Could be anything. So that's another major sign that you guys are about to level up when you start to feel these intense emotions that something huge is about to happen for your life. So yeah, please stay aware of that. This has happened for everybody, but that's a big sign for me. This is what I've dealt with in my life. So speaking from experience, of course. <laughs> so getting on to the next sign that you guys are about to level up is... 
you guys are healing through so much right now you guys are letting go of a lot of emotional trauma childhood trauma you guys are letting go of so much right now right when you guys are about to level up you know god is essentially you know healing you to get to where you need to be because we need to have a certain state of mind we need to be thinking a certain type of way before we reach the next level right so it's like we have we have to heal if there's anything that we need to heal before getting to reaching that next level right you know god's gonna make sure we heal it <laughs> the universe is like nope uh you need to heal this you need to get through this you need to do the work honey because we're not about to um bring you to the next level we're not going to bring you to the top until you know you've at least healed like maybe like 70 80 percent a little bit more you know you're not quite there yet you're almost but not quite there um i've noticed this with me it's like after it's it's almost like healing through your shadow self of course you gotta love the good and the bad you know to reach to the next level you know being at peace with your shadow self you know with in a, essentially your dark your dark side right but it's a lot you know it's a lot healing through trauma and pain and you know childhood wounds you know um, parent wounds mother father wounds you know what i mean um but we have to we have to go through that we have to let go and that's what god is showing you essentially like god is having you let go of certain things so you can move on you can let go you can heal from it make peace with it in order to reach the top in order to level up go to the next level it's essential it needs to happen you know and a lot of people resist you can't resist you gotta just let it go you gotta surrender to it you know and that's i've struggled with that so, and I mean, let me know if you guys have struggled with surrendering, you know, healing, the healing process and letting go of what you need to let go of. I know it's hard. It, it really is. <laughs> Trust me. That is another big sign that God is trying to level you guys up and bring you to the top and bring you to where you need to be. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I enjoyed making this video for you. I felt like it was very imperative. I've been putting off making this video for a while so super happy i finally got it out there yay um but yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed it i will see you guys in the next video please take care of yourself love yourself and in case you don't see a good afternoon good evening and good night and yeah catch you later guys bye